Welcome to On the Streets with CV Sand, your inside look at some of the ways Castro Valley Sanitary District provides high performance, low cost wastewater services. Today we're hitting the streets with CV Sand's CCTV crew to learn some of the ways they use that technology to keep Castro Valley's wastewater moving. Let's go meet the crew. Senior collection system maintenance workers Gilbert E. and Kevin Dipp work as a team to conduct inspections of Castro Valley's sewer system, which consists of over 160 miles of public sewer mains, and they do it using closed circuit television, aka CCTV. Using this technology, the team is able to assess the structural quality of Castro Valley sewer system and find issues that have a negative impact on the performance of the sewer system. Structurally, our most common issues in Castro Valley would be fractured pipe and broken pipe. Maintenance wise, we would have fats oil greases, which we refer to as fog, and we have root intrusions that come in through the broken joints or cracks that we have in the pipe. When the CCTV team arrives for a pipe inspection, their first order of business is to prep the crawler. So here at CV Sand, uh, we use two different crawlers. Um, that's the actual body that the wheels and camera head connect to. And we have three total cameras that snap onto the front end that's interchangeable between both of them. Uh, along with that, there's different wheels, wheel configurations that we could attach to each one of the crawlers. Being able to customize the CCTV crawler allows the team to inspect sewer pipes of various sizes. Pipes from 6 inches in diameter all the way up to 36 inches in diameter. The unique design of the crawler also eliminates the possibility of it flipping over and allows for easy maneuvering inside the sewer system. Uh, we got two different camera heads here. The one that's currently attached is our DigiSewer camera head. It's got a variety of different rows of LED lights inside of the little protective housing that you can control from the computer inside. So for the purposes of today's inspection, we want to be able to turn the camera and look up in different directions, which is what our other camera head does. So I'm gonna go ahead and swap those out, throw some anti-fog on the lens and get going. So yeah, Mike, so everything is ready to go. Once I drop it in, it all connects back to the control room. So go ahead and check it out. All right, cool, man. And when you guys see these cones out here, please do us a favor and slow down. Thank you. Castro Valley sewer system is divided into 12 basins. It takes the team approximately five years to visually inspect the entire public sewer system. CV Sand's current crawler, named Rover X, can inspect approximately 30 feet of pipe per minute. It's a big job and one that takes a lot of hard work and dedication. Once the crawler is lowered into the sewer pipe, it begins sending back digital images to the control room that is located inside the CCTV truck. This is where the video data from the crawler is recorded and analyzed and where the crawler is controlled. So this is the joystick that gets the controller moving forward, reverse, and, and turning so we can actually maneuver up the pipe and around things as need be if, if uh, we need to. And this one here is the pan and tilt for this specific setup that we have. So we can look up the pipe and we can turn it and look up at different angles, which is helpful. CV Sand's specialized CCTV equipment is versatile and reliable. It allows collection system maintenance workers to complete detailed inspections of the sewer system and to notify CV Sand's engineering department of defects that need to be corrected as they are discovered. This right here I'll point out is the uh, information as I start coding. There's going to be defects marked as it, as it goes through, and this gets graded through uh, the PAC-P NASCO uh, software and gives it a rating. So this is useful to the engineering department because they'll be able to get an overall score of the condition of this particular pipe. Without regular maintenance and inspection of CV Sand sewer pipelines, the community would face an increased risk of sanitary sewer overflows, aka SSOs. This would mean raw sewage spilling out of manholes onto the street, in waterways, and even inside homes. Obstructions in the public sewer mains such as fats, oils and grease, fog, foreign objects, damage from tree roots, and aging infrastructure can cause SSOs. CV Sand is always working to keep our community safe with regular maintenance and inspections. 
in the past, before CCTV existed, it was basically guesswork and more reactive. Now with the CCTV in maintenance and repairs, we can have a proactive approach on, on planning and, and taking care of much needed uh, infrastructure. Kevin Gilbert, thanks for letting us uh, tag along today, man, and seeing what you do for the community. We really appreciate it. I know you got a full day ahead of you at work, so I'm gonna let you get to it, all right? Learn more about the high-performance, low-cost wastewater services CBSAN provides at cbsan.org/wastewater.